Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and this is one drop dead gorgeous 66 GTO convertible. Man, you're gonna love checking this one out. Look at that paint dance in the sun, man. She is like a brandy wine, looks like a glass of Merlot sparkling in the sun, man. She is absolutely gorgeous. Tri power, four speed. Now all the chrome's looking sweet, the paint's looking sweet, the convertible top. I mean, wait till you see the finishes on this thing. Absolutely beautiful, man. I just love this car. Now as you look down the side there, the bodywork is looking sweet. Just beautiful job. I tell you, my hat is off to whoever did the bodywork on this car. You can see that all the stainless is all polished up looking good. All the chrome is looking sweet. And wait till you check out the interior here. Look at that. Door panels look like they're brand new. All the handles and everything, the chrome is looking beautiful. You see all the chrome on the dash is looking sweet. That steering wheel chrome is looking sweet. The center console is looking amazing. All the upholstery is looking good on the seats. It looks like the carpeting's new. That back seat also looks like it's new. The whole convertible top frame looks like it was restored. The bottom side of the convertible top's in great shape. Just everything about this thing is looking absolutely gorgeous. And you gotta check out the hearse wheels. Those hearse wheels really make this car. I tell you, those are some rare puppies right there to find those. You can see the GTO emblem's looking good. We got great looking chrome on the back bumper. All the trim here's looking sweet. Love the covers. This is how you can tell you got a 66, those covers on the taillights. Of course, it's got dual exhaust. Now, I got three keys here, and I'm going to guess it's this one. I'm usually not. Ah, look at that. First guess, baby. And look at that trunk. Now, whenever you're buying a muscle car, I suggest you look at the trunk floor because these trunk floors really took a beating, especially cars that sat outside all the time. These, uh, the gutter system around these openings, as you can see, all you would need is a little water to get down in here and it'd find its way down and around and into the trunk. And then your car would sit there and that water sit in the trunk floor. You can see that the bottom side of the deck lid's looking good. And then this lip here also, the water would come down here and sit on the edge of that lip. So make sure you check out the lips on your trunk lids. Now you can look down the passenger side there. She's straight as an arrow. I'll tell you what, beautiful workmanship. I mean, you can see all the reflections in the paint. I mean, it looks like a mirror and it's red. So we got a red mirror, metallic, brandy wine, looking sweet. Of course, we're going to put the convertible top down here in a minute and show you what's going on there. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we do not do any consignment whatsoever. That means we own this car, so you know we did our homework before we laid out our money. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and we'll tell you all about it. Alright, we're going to show you how the top goes down. Now you've got two latches. You've got one here and over on the passenger side just like that. So you just flip that little latch right there and then you've got your switch right here to put your top down. There you go. Let the sun shine in. All right, it is convertible time. Let's take this GTO for a ride. 
Sun's out. Let's go to the beach. Here we go, man. Sounding good, looking good. Tops down, getting some sun, having some fun. Call Tom anytime and he'll tell you all about this car and just how easy it is to park this dream in your drive. At Vanguard Motor Sales, we can ship anywhere in the world. You just give Tom a call just about any time of day or night. He will pick up the phone and tell you all about this beautiful machine. Talking about machines, looks like we got us a skidster in front of us. Play a little chicken with the skidster. I don't know, he's gonna wait on me or I'm gonna wait on him. I don't see him looking at there. There he's looking at me. Nope, we're gonna wait on him. Nope, now we're gonna, he's gonna wait on us. There he is. Getting a thumbs up from these guys. I love it. So back to my story, you can see down here on the dash, everything is looking sweet. Look at those gauges, look at that wood. I mean, everything looking sweet. She is a beauty. Now we'd love to have you come in and visit. So please, if you have the time and means, come on in and visit. We love to have visitors of Vanguard. If you want to send an inspector, got no problem with you send an inspector. Just give us a call, let us know somebody's coming. That way we can make sure we got your favorite vehicle right up front. We do have a lot of square footage and we have a lot of cars. So every now and then we might have to move half a dozen or a dozen cars just to get to your favorite one. And I'd like to have it up there ready for you to take a look at. Now a lot of times guys can fly in in the morning, take a look at cars, fly right back out and be home for dinner. So you can make the trip in one day if you'd like. Or if you want to come to Detroit, check out the Motor City. You know, we've got uh, the Henry Ford Museum here, the whole nine yards. So we're going to put this baby up in the uh, air for you right now so you can check out the underside. All right, we're underneath the 66 now, and man, is it pretty under here. Look at that gas tank, man. She is beautiful. Polished stainless steel. we got brand new straps. We've got some nice rubber isolators on here. Floorboards are looking good. Now the exhaust looks like it's brand new. Look at that. Still got the sticker on it. Um, the floorboards are all painted up. I see new body mounts there also. And then we've got um, air shocks here so we, you can adjust the uh, ride height on there. Uh, we got brand new bushings and lower control arms. We do have a sway bar on here. We got brand new brake lines. 323 gear in here. It is an open rear end. Uh, obviously the fuel line's brand new too. Uh, we got some stock appearing mufflers here. Uh, it's got the extra bracing here going down um, from the frame down here to the uh, lower control arms. The control arms are the reinforced ones. The uh, bushings up on the top also look like they're new. We got new fuel line, new brake line going front to back. We got nice paint on the frame, nice paint on the floorboards. Uh, the parking brake cable looks like it's new. Uh, we've got a Muncie Trans here, that's a four speed. We got the stock appearing bell housing, the stock clutch linkage, stock appearing starter. Uh, I can see that it looks like we got new ball joints, we got new tie rod ends, we got new calipers, we got new flex lines. The upper ball joint also looks like it's new. I mean, everything under here looks new. You guys are gonna need to invest in some uh, mirrors so you can put them underneath the car. You definitely gonna wanna show this off and then you're gonna be like me. You're gonna be putting this baby up on jack stands in your driveway and getting under here with Windex and a big roll of paper towels, keeping this baby clean like I used to do on my car. We got good looking tires here. Now these are the wide ovals that look like uh, bias ply tires, but they're actually radials. And it should say, yep, see right there, it says radial. But it looks like the uh, bias ply. We got the Hearst wheels on here looking sweet. We got the rocker moldings, they're all polished up looking good. Um, I always feel around on the back sides of the front fenders because again, this is one of the first places to go on these cars. This is nice and smooth, so no patchwork there. Always look at the rocker, always look at the pinch weld. The rocker molding itself is in beautiful shape. Frame's also in beautiful shape. Now there's a big hole right here. I always try to look inside there and check out the inside of the frame. Out back here, again, same good looking tire and wheel. And I didn't tell you the size in the front, but it's a 7014. Uh, we're gonna get under the hood right now and see what's going on. 
All right, under the hood here, we got a 350 block it started out as, and this baby's been bored and stroked out to 389. That's what the previous owners told us. Uh, it's, you can see it's got the tri-power setup on it looking good. We got power brakes, power steering. Uh, I see brand new spark plug wires there. You can see that the rag joint here is brand new. That's something you want to look at on every car. You see that upper control arm. You can see the brand new bushings in there. You see the brand new bushing on top of the shock. You can see they cleaned up the exhaust manifolds, but they didn't paint them. Now you can get some of that high heat paint and put on there and make it look like bare metal. You can see that it's got brand new valve cover gaskets. Those valve covers, chrome's looking good. We got great looking uh, firewall there, it's all cleaned up. The inner wheelhouses are all cleaned up, looking good. The whole front section here around the radiator, also looking good. On a lot of these Pontiacs, this looks like shit. We put um, these shutoffs on every car, so you just spin that open and it shuts off the power. You don't have to worry about any mistakes or anything going on. We got chassis black on the bottom side of the hood. You can see we got a new spring and pin. The safety latch has been recoded, looking sweet. I mean, everything about this thing, this is show and go, guys, and the top goes down. You gotta hit the beach with this one. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Shows park this stream in your driveway.